<laughs> there's something very wrong with you. And if you don't already know that, then fucking thank me for telling you that by fucking you. <laughs> but you have two options as a lady. You have a guy over here who's like, uh, you know, uh, I love you, you're beautiful, you're amazing, you're perfect, I want to give you money and cupcakes and prizes and shit, right? <laughs> Then you have a guy over here who's like, I don't like you, uh, go away, you're the worst, uh, boo to you. <laughs> and then every time I just weigh the two, I'm like, all right, this guy has prizes. <laughs> this guy does not like me. All right, that's, that's good things to think about, weigh the two, balance it out, figure it out, it's a hard one, you know? And every time you start it like, I try to fix a shitty guy every single time and it never fucking works. It's never worked. It's never paid off, right? I met a guy recently who I thought was like, this is for me. This is the right choice for me. He was like, I always say like, I want a guy who is, uh, you know, he gets it, but he can fix shit, you know? And my friends would always be like, there's no funny lumberjacks. That's a weird uh, request. <laughs> But I met a guy who was amazing, like incredible, and he was funny and lovely, and he like lived in Vermont in the woods, you know? Like in a house in the woods, not in the actual woods, like a weird creature. But he was like incredible, and he would like send me pictures of himself building his deck. He's like, look, I built a deck, you know? And I'd write back like, ah, oh, I took a taxi two blocks, we're different, you know? <laughs> but I went out there. I went out there to visit him, I went to Vermont, I sledded, I'm from LA, I sledded for this guy, right? I went to the Goodwill, I bought a head to toe red snowsuit, I went careening down the hill, he was like, oh look, it's the Red Baron. And uh, I said, are you making fun of me because I can't have children? And, uh, <laughs> but that was fun. That was fun that that happened. And then I go to New York and he was like, I wanna come see you. And I gave him permission, because he's a grown man and he needs that gave him permission to come see me. He was so happy. He was so happy I gave him permission to come see me. He wrote back, I can't stop smiling, XOXO. Yeah, a guy who built a deck couldn't stop smiling, XOXO. <laughs> I don't know if it's because I'm a comedian, because I moved around a lot as a kid, and I'm just a cynical person, but it took all of the willpower in my entire being to not write back, like, Fag. <laughs> you fucking faggot. <laughs> Maybe that's why I'm single, right? Maybe that's why I can't find... <laughs> I can't find anybody, because the minute someone says, I love you, my first thought is like, Oh, oh, you love me. I want to go suck a dick if you love me so much. <laughs> 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 No, Morgan, I think you're beautiful. Oh, is this as beautiful as a fucking dick in your mouth? You're beautiful. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's how mature I get. I'm pretty mature. 